Have you ever wondered how the Jewish calendar works and how it came about? The Jewish month begins with a thin crescent. The moon grows until it is full, wanes until it cannot be seen, and eventually reappears. This cycle takes approximately 29 and a half days. Since a month needs to consist of complete days, a month in the Jewish calendar is sometimes 29 days, and sometimes 30 days. The solar orbit consists of 365 and a quarter days. The difference between 12 lunar months and the solar year is almost 11 days. The Torah, however, states that Passover must be in springtime. If no adjustment were made, Passover would occur 11 days earlier each year, eventually drifting into winter, then fall, summer, and spring again. The Jewish calendar thus presents two challenges. Who determines whether a month is 29 or 30 days? How can the lunar and solar cycles be coordinated and balanced? In Biblical and Mishnaic times, the Sanhedrin was responsible for determining the months and years. On the 30th day of every month, they would cross-examine witnesses who claimed to have seen the new moon. If the witnesses' accounts were corroborated, that day would be declared the first of the month. The previous month was now retroactively determined to have had only 29 days. If no testimony were accepted, the Sanhedrin would declare the following day the first of the new month. In order to balance the solar and lunar cycles, the Sanhedrin periodically inserted an extra month into a year, creating a Shana Mu'uberet, or pregnant year, more commonly known as a leap year. This was the situation until the middle of the 4th century, at which time the Romans forcibly disbanded the Sanhedrin. Hillel II, the last leader of the Sanhedrin and a descendant of Rabbi Yehuda Hanasi, anticipated this. Therefore, before the Sanhedrin was disbanded, they established a fixed calendar for posterity. The Sanhedrin declared and established all future new months and leap years, granting the fixed calendar the same validity as the original system. To this day, Jews throughout the world use this sophisticated structure created by Rabbi Hillel. Throughout the centuries, the calendar has been one of the backbones of Jewish unity, as it has ensured that Jews the world over celebrate and observe the Jewish holidays on the very same day. <laughs>